to ask you about being a young guy as much anymore. Yeah. Now we have to ask you what it's like to have all these young guys below you. What's, yeah, what's it yeah. like to be a veteran back here? Um, it feels great. Um, I know um, I have to come out here and show some of the young guys a lot of things, mm -hmm. like uh, just like Jeremy and Tudor and Ty Holmes, mm -hmm. and the rest of them showed me and Brandon. So, uh, you know, it's great being back out here, get ready for another season, mm -hmm. a great season that we're looking forward to. Um, you know, uh, we got a chip on our shoulder because um, it's a lot of things that people are saying right now that we don't like. <laughs> so, therefore, you know, uh, we're ready to get this count going and get everything started and get rolling. How do you uh, manage that, though, mentally, when, when you when you know there are a lot of motivators out there, as you mentioned, a lot of people saying things that obviously turn it into motivation ultimately for you guys, but you got to pace yourself a little bit. I'm sure you know you can't you can't go out there and, and play the games tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. So is that tough to do though? When, when is, you have it, all that out there that's being said, it's very tough to do. But we know we have to uh, set our game plans up for every game, and mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna take every game every week and every Saturday we play or every Thursday, whatever game it comes to. We're gonna take that one game at a time, and then we look forward to our next game. So right now. I mean, with no game ahead right now, with these two weeks we're going to have, mm -hmm. um, we're just going to do our thing. Count, uh, go by our play, run our playbook, make sure we got everything 100. Mm -hmm. And then from there, we go to NC, uh, North Carolina Central and do everything from there and go to the next games, and then we'll be good. You've obviously been through this experience a lot before, you know, going through junior year, but just talk about, how, does anything feel different this year at all compared to past years? Um, Every year is a different feeling. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, like you say, I'm older now, too. You know, I done came from freshman, sophomore, all the way to junior. Mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, everything, get, it, it turns up a little bit more. It go from zero to 100 real quick. Yeah. So um, we're just ready, man. And um, me being a leader and being age now, older and things like that, I know I have a different leadership I have to take, uh, take control of in the role. And that's to get these young guys ready because you never know anything can happen. Right. Yeah. What's uh, dorm life like? What's what's maybe the, the best and the worst thing about living in the dorm with these guys? Oh, I'm sure man. there are probably some really good things and some really bad things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Being able to live in your own place and with a big bed is a totally different thing. <laughs> you know, being here on the twin size bed, we some big fellas. Yeah. But, you know, we had to go through two weeks of it, I mean, which is not long, but we got to do it. Yeah. And uh, we're brothers, and so this is what, this what makes us bond right here, this time right here. This is what other people don't understand. Some mm -hmm. things, you know, you don't want to do it, but you have to. Right. That's what makes us bond. This is what's going to get us started.